Ye, yeah. unajua msiye bifa apate kiti anasemanga tutengeneza barabara akipata kiti anatengeneza wanawake. So kasful. Uli ni promise simu. Tafadhali nilete hiyo simu. So uh, juzi tu tumeama leo tumeona anaitwa uh, Dufla Diligon amesema kwamba KRG has gone broke. What do you have to comment about that? But unajua mtu kama KRG akienda broke Mungu alimbariki na sura. Yeye hata mama anaweza most. Yeah, yeah <laughs> kuna advantage. Because sikiwa answer mu na usio na mama sana hayana yani shida. So unasema hayana problem. Yeah. Here with them was Facebook eh Hey, mm. na leo kwa numa muaje mrembo wa facebook mnamjua she's not new and uh, tunataka tupige story na ye atuambie amekuwa vipi how is life tumeona ametoka kwa show ya chipukizi and also atuambie experience imekuwaje hi mama niko poa sana uh -huh. mm. leo uko down kwa sawa ha niko sawa uh -huh. yeah kuna kitu ni zafanya ni kwe down uh -huh. <laughs> na maybe ile siku kal graf alikufanya ile kitu uka feel uko down no she is feeling niko down because when you are a virgin hata mwanaume ake kudamb uko tu sawa uko safe so ame kudamb haja ni damb uh -huh. ananipea time at least ni divert sura kidogo uh -huh. yeah ikuwe kama ni kiminaji hata kama mtu uh -huh. mm. sura ndo shida sure si si sura peke yake uh -huh. Pia matters affecting society mm -hmm. ni shida nyuma pia ni mbaya. Mm -hmm. yeah. Alright let's talk about your comedy. Leo uh, tumekuwa hapa kwa Chipkizi show na you've really done a good job. Mm -hmm. Na we ni demo ambayo you really doing a good job. Na watu wengi wao wanajiuliza demo wa Facebook ujipanga vipi labda ukienda pale kupeana mistari zako kufanya comedy zako how well do you prepare? No unapata kama hii niliona mm -hmm. interview ya Ivu Ngai. Mm -hmm. Chipkizi akisema na kama uko na content mm -hmm. come. Mm -hmm. So jana mimi nilimwambia ni pay stage. Mm. Akaniambia nitumie video yako mm. then nione kama nitakupea stage. Mm. Nikamtumia jana leo asubuhi akanitumia invite. Mm. So hata siku prepare stage. Yeah. But nienda tu kaingia hivyo. Nimekuja tu nikaingia hivyo. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Uh, maybe the most Facebook pale ukiwa stage you make jokes. At times people don't laugh as good to check. Maybe unachukulianga aje kama watu wanza check. Ni sawa tu ni same na ukatie demo ya kukata. Si unaenda kwa mwingine. Stage ya kwanza ikata si hizi give up. Unaenda kwa next. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Okay. Okay, uh, demo wa Facebook. Uh, kuna wakati watu wengi kwa industry but anaka na wana eh hey, maisha yangu hai change. Mm. Naona ni kama watu hawanikubali. Mm. Naona ni kama vitu na do it like hazibambi. Maybe do you feel at some point una feel I should I give up? Maybe in a history ya comedy mimi naye ku give up siwezi. Siwezi give up hata kwa dawa. Wapende wasipende al push mpaka ni make it. Mm -hmm. Yeah, you industry ni ngumu ku make it. Mm -hmm. Ni ngumu sana uki give up. Mm -hmm. Wewe maybe ukutaka it talent. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Okay. Okay the last time you came into social media ulisema kwamba hauna simu ya kupiga comedy na uliomba kasi pula kaku promise pale atakupea simu maybe alikupea Ah hakunipea yeah alisema tu atanipea but hakunipea but for me simu hizi ni uzuia kutopiga content mimi na kuna matumaini matumaini ya let us let me ndapiga tu content sio naweza mwambia nini Kaspul wacha kukuwa na fake promises kama za MCA. Unajua MCA before apate kiti anasemanga tutengeneza barabara akipata kiti anatengeneza wanawake. So Kaspul, uli ni promise simu. Tafadhali nilete hiyo simu. Ah. So uh, juzi tu tumeama leo tumeona uh, anaitwa Dufla Diligon. Amesema kwamba KRG has gone broke. What do you have to comment about that? But unajua mtu kama KRG akienda broke, Mungu alimbariki na sura. Yeye hata mama anaweza most. Yeah, yeah kuna advantage. Because sikiwa answer mu na usio na mama sana hayana yani shida. So unasema hayana problem. Hayana yeah, shida tumie sura yake kupata pesa. Eh. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, Dimo Facebook pale kwenye mtandao tuliona Pastor Ezekiel was like a, what was your was channel anaitwa Diana cuz the demonic. Kuna dhani jina inafaa kujudge mtu. Mimi nezaambia Pastor Ezekiel malaya ni malaya tu. Na demo akupeana anaweza peana bila pombe anaweza peana akikunywa maji. So jina sioni kiditamani kitu yoyote. Mm -hmm. Ah, juu sisi wenyewe tumeitwa Diana tutakosa mandoa juu tuliyekuwa Diana. Wewe Diana ngapi unajua kwa ndoa? Diana pia ameshikilia ndoa. Kuna msanii ndoa yake inaenda vizuri kama ya Diana. Bi sasa akisema watu wasikilie ndoa mm -hmm. anataka aje. Mm -hmm. Eh. Okay. So, will we be seeing you again on stage next week ama hizo shows zinakuja? Mungu akipenda mimi nataka zote. Nda force issue and ni make it. Mm -hmm. Eh hey, vile mapandisha hivi mafuta at least ni kwa na range rover. Mm -hmm. mm. Kumekuwa na hizi speculation kuwa demo Facebook akiitwa show ama akiitwa mahali uh, huwa hapati anything. Like kuna wale uh, comedian ambao wanalipwa, wana ku appreciated. But as for you unaitwa ngwa tu unaenda kwa stage unamaliza unatoka. Maybe is it true ama ni rumors? Yeah, zingine ni ukweli because kuna show nilienda hadi nikafunga show nilipiga show for three hours. Mm -hmm. Na nilikuwa the best your day. 
na si kupewa deep fair ya bold how does it make you feel ah ilinifanya nika feel vibaya but unapata mse demo unajua kwa industry umejituma umepiga show 3 hours kwa stage comedy siki tu rais uchekesha wa Kenya na hii mafuta vile imepanda wacheke mm. then wase wametoa pesa na upewa deep fair nilika hapo mpaka asubuhi kapambazuka nikadandia mati nikarudi Bless na kaya yeah, sasa nilikasirika mm. but for now show zingine na demand nasema untumie do fulani ndio nikam mm-hmm. yeah uh, maybe as a comedian tunaona pale ringtone amekuja kwenye mtandao and is like a uh, an apologizer kwa Eric Mondi at here lilala na mama ke you as a comedian is it good to put uh, other people's family into comedy ah that is bad unaweza tumia tu kwa mfano ni yari utumie mtu na bibi yake ama side chick na make sense lakini mzazi Ah hapa hapana hapa alifanya makosa. Yeah. Ukiwa ukiingia live TikTok mostly wao wanaingia live TikTok and also wao wana join live TikTok zako. But mm. zile vitu ambavyo wao huongea mm-hmm. watu wengi hujiuliza kama hizo vitu wao ufanya. Mm. You know what you always talk on TikTok, right? Mm-hmm. Labda hizo vitu ambavyo unaongea uh, ni vitu ambavyo wao ufanya and also how does your family take it when wakisikia ukiongea hizo vitu ambavyo uongea? Sasa wazazi yangu kama walifail kunisomesha mbona comedy nikingangana nao wabambane na mm-hmm sawa wanasikia tu nikiwa tajiri huku wanani support but most of the time huwa naongea hivyo unajua unapata mademu wengi kwa mtandao huwa nawaambia wasibleach kama sura Mungu akikuumba ukae kama mimi na simbo boy wewe jikubali ama niaje juu pesa ni token hata size yetu akikuwa western alikuwa kama mimi lakini sasa hii pesa ikaingia akakuwa kama nikiminaji so Unapata kwa mtandao mademu wako na depression wana bleach wanaongeza makalio in which i make sense mm-hmm. jumanaoma kukupenda atakupenda tu na hiyo aga yako brief kama ile ya chokora unaona mm-hmm. so mimi wanaambia mademu nasemanga hivyo ndio mademu waone at least wajipende vile wako mm-hmm. mm-hmm. ni kitu gani fun na shei kuambia kikakuuma sana yani a comment let's say a comment akakwambia na ukasema we inayo imenifikia hata kama wewe uko na roho ngumu eh niliambiwa hata nikipaka makeup mm-hmm. <laughs> Baada tu sura yangu ita round off to near rest Lukaku nikasema hey wisha mimi nikasema Mungu acha nikuwe na roho safi mambo na sura tutatumia nikiwa na pesa mm-hmm. eh hey. oh, maybe the last time we checked uh, ulikuwa ita branchira pale kwenye mtandao ulikuwa namwambia utampea mechi ya free maybe what's your relationship with him no wanaume Kenya ni wachache alafu wakuwe magei sisi wanawe wengine tukiingia kwa mandoa za watu tunalaaniwa unaona siwezi enda kwa mbaba mwenye yako na bibi na chira hapa hapa ndio kwa gei si anipeyo ni nini tumie yake mbona ya kuwa gei na mademu watatu na mungu sasa nilikuwa nataka kumpea free match ndio atest tu hiyo joto but kama chira haja test by the way nilikuwa nataka atest hiyo joto i swear chira sasa yake kwa malaika kwa wanawake mimi nilikuwa nataka kwani nifikishana wapi eh nifikishana wapi kwenye hii conversation nilimuita friendly mpaka akachukua namba yangu hivi tumekuwa kwa bash juice nikamwambia chira nataka friendly na we serious anajigoroga mimi nilitaka any gay mnyaka hapo nje akuje friendly kwangu tu kama kina passes zake wameshinda wameshindwa kuwasaidia mimi niko ready kuwapea but you always say when ni virgin na wewe unapea naga unaitishaga kila mtu kumpatia friendly kwa specific na kuanga virgin kwa masikio <laughs> <laughs> sijai kwa specific eh hey, but wa, mimi wanasema biblia inasema mkoona akutoe na barikiwa mbona mguu wangu nikipea chira isikose kubarikiwa <laughs> eh hey, na nimemsaidia or maybe still on chira tuliona pale alikuwa anasema anatusi watu ili ajulikane like for relevance hmm. ana wetu naona unajituma for relevance maybe what can you tell mama by the way chira naye amezidi acha kutukana watu eh yeah, anaamka na ropoka nilikuwa nimengoja tu skull graph ndio mimi nimpache because eh huwezi kuja maybe umekuwa kwa industry ni kama vile One year I think ndio nimefikisha one year. Cuz alikuwa anasema pale wenye umefikisha 10 years hmm. wa retire wa Kenya. Sasa wa retire ni yeye mwenyewe analia kinanyakoa mchangie rent. Yeye anaweza kuombea maisha yake hata na apoko peke yake. Na yeye anaishi kwa imani. <laughs> Chira mwenyewe analia kila siku tutume maros ya 10 10. Ndio at least alipe rent. Anakuombea hata na KRG mtu ameka 10 years. Siba akuje kwa mtandao. Unajua shida chira ni upcoming tuseme tu kweli. Hata mimi ni upcoming but hii ukikuja kwa mtandao ni sema saa hii. Oh kina winja watoke kwa mtandao nao ndio tuna learn sasa utakuwa na wakusaidia aje so chira anafanya mistake mm-hmm. yeye kama content imemshinda acha tu akue gauge yeye inaweza kuwa imemkubali <laughs> anyway wacha tumalize aongelesha uh, watu wako ongelesha mafans wako ambao wanakupenda sana wanakusupport na uzidi kuwa mle mzuri hivyo vinyo uko you, you really doing a good job yeah mimi ni mzuri na kitu ya kwanza mimi nimeokoka <laughs> na Yesu ni bwana si admit simulevi nikipata pesa ndalewa hiyo ni ukweli ni pesa una ni pesa sina 
ndio sasa nimeshikilia ibara na neno <laughs> so mimi naambia watu watu support na mimi i swear na na promise uh-huh. sitawa let down mm-hmm. nataka mwaka ikisha ni kwe level moja na MC Tricky kwa stage ndio maana kila show naenda hata zingine mm-hmm. spoiled but unapata tumeenda because niko na passion ya kupiga stage mm-hmm. yeah Maybe all right the next big thing to expect kutoka kwako Big thing nilikuwa nimeanza kufikiria mambo hata ya kununua pikipiki wakapandisha mafuta mwenye ndo. Wameua ndo tu. But for me na sema Mr President umefanya vizuri kupandisha mafuta pia. Why because wanaume wa magari wajai tuongoza mademu wenye tume kutoka webamba siko baya. Mimi kuna mwenye alisimamisha na gari yake akaniambia nitie wewe mwingine. Unaona sasa akipandisha mafuta hawa wanaume tutapatana hapo kwa foot na tutajua. Anyway, asante sana demo wa Facebook. God bless you so much. Thank you very important. Ukupate wapi on media? Mnipate kila mahali Facebook, Twitter, YouTube, hata Nairobi archives ukiniona wenipate. Sawa, bye. Demo wa Facebook. Sawa.